Hello friends, welcome back to Technique and this is Normal here and in this video we will be doing the performance testing of the new Redmi 12 5G. So Redmi 12 5G is the first device in India to come with the Snapdragon 4 Gen 2 chip which is a 4 nanometer manufacturing process and this is one of the really good uh, budget chip available right now and Redmi 12 has this and this is coupled with either 4 or uh, rather 6 gigabyte RAM and 8 gigabyte RAM. Uh, we have the 8 GB RAM with us and uh, we will be doing the performance testing of this device. Although this is a budget device, many of you might be interested in knowing how good the performance of this device is. So let's get started with the performance testing of the Redmi 12 5G. So we will be using the, uh, the throttling test, the stress test, attitude benchmark, the Geekbench. So all of these we will be doing and uh, see how good the performance is on this device. So let's begin. So before that, if this is your first time on this channel, do hit that uh, subscribe button and also hit the bell icon to get notified of all the videos we publish so let's begin so first let's start with the, the cpu throttling test so let's go to the options you can see here uh, 20 thread and i will end the test in 15 minutes so that's the one we are going to uh, see here uh, so that's the test so let's save this and we'll start the test right now so we can see here 76 percentage of the battery right now so let's uh, start the test uh, so there you go so let's come back after the throttling test is complete and see how the performance is. So now we are completed with uh, the throttling test of this device and you can see here uh, it uh, throttled to 94% of its max performance in the 15 minute test. Uh, probably in 30 minute test it might be a different uh, value but uh, right now with 15 minutes of throttling test uh, because it's a budget device. Uh, it. Uh, it's not a very, I mean, kind of very powerful device. It's more like a budget device. So for that, this is quite good performance, 94 performance uh, percentage of its max performance and around 5 percentage drop uh, in battery uh, after the uh, throttling test. So that was a throttling test. One max value is 184 and minimum value is 159. Next, let's go to the uh, extreme uh, stress test of this device. So 3D Mark uh, Wildlife Extreme uh, test, uh, Stress Test. So this is a 20 round test and let's see how the scores are. So now we completed with the wildlife extreme uh, stress test. Uh, so best uh, loop score is 158 and lowest uh, loop score is 154. Stability is 97.5 uh, percentage. Uh, let's have a battery uh, temperature look. You can see here uh, 26 to 30 degrees and battery uh, it went from 71 percentage to 67 percentage. So just 4 percentage drop. Again this is a budget device so you can see here. A frame rate 1 to 2 fps so it's very low actually uh, then uh, you can see the battery temp temperature as well 26 to 30 degrees so that's the wildlife extreme uh, stress test on this device so it's a very basic device again a budget device so let's go to next to the uh, geekbench and uh, the antidote benchmark uh, score so here we have the antidote benchmark uh, test so let's just open it and you can see the we already completed the test and you can see the score here uh, this is using the GPU is actually using the light version. We are not sure why it is, but Antutu is using that. Now you can see here 4 lakh 25,000 is the score for this device uh, uh, in the budget segment. Uh, so it's a pretty good score actually. 4 and a half lakh, almost 4 uh, lakh 25,000 is the score. The GPU score is here as well. Then uh, let's also do the storage test. So you can see here storage test value. Uh, it's uh, the UFS 2.2 storage, which is quite decent, I would say, for this budget segment. 54, 565 is the score, and the read, write, and other values are here as well. So that is the uh, benchmark score. Now, and finally, we'll uh, just uh, see uh, the Geekbench score as well, and then we'll uh, 
you can see here this is the Geekbench test. We'll run this and I will see the final results as well. So here is the Geekbench uh, result. You can see here 909 is the Geekbench 6 uh, single core score and 2018 is the multi core score. So this is how the device performed and it's quite a good score I would say for a budget device which is priced around 11,000 rupees. It's a pretty good score actually. So that was the performance testing of uh, this uh, device the Redmi 12 5G and let's go to the about phone you can see here MIUI 14.0.2 Redmi 12 5G detail specs uh, Snapdragon 4 Gen 2 mobile platform 8GB RAM and Android 13 is the version. So that was the performance testing. So overall we feel this is quite a good uh, chip uh, for the budget segment, the Snapdragon 4 Gen 2 and it's a 4 nanometer chip which makes it even more uh, interesting because it is battery efficient as well. So overall uh, for this price segment, this device definitely does pretty good job here. So what do you guys think about uh, this chip? Do let us know in the comment section. So this is normal signing off with the performance testing of the Redmi 12 5G. Hope you enjoyed watching this video. Do hit that like button and also hit the subscribe button for more videos. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you in our next video. Have a great day.